Hello, good morning or good evening to everyone. Welcome to my intern tutorials. Today in this DB2 practical session tutorial, I'm going to show you how do we insert a data into a DB2 table. Okay, straight away, let me connect to the main from system and connect to the QMF. And let's enter a query of how do we insert a data into a table so in the last video I have shown you how do we create a table so now I'm going to insert a table insert a data into the table so using insert is the query so we can insert the data insert into table name table name is table 1 and uh, what fields it has like employee ID employee name uh, employee salary employee department right so now I'm gonna have to add the values so values would be like uh, employee ID star one two three four two okay then we will take it as Robert as name and okay salary is like five Fifty thousand bucks. Okay, department is like mm, programmer. Okay, so all this should be, or you can say QA. Okay, okay, then press F2 to run the query. So it is asking like on your run command do you want to make these changes yes make the changes permanently to the database yes just press enter so that your you can see a number of rows modified in the database is one so with this you can insert a query into the database so let me comment this and let's run a select query so where you found to see how many records it has okay table one press F2 so you can see the latest record is Robert so it has been entered here and you can see the department and you can see the salary and employee name so total records it has is 2 right so now what I would like to do is uh, go back to the query panel and give a comment to this so if you comment here so I'll try to insert the same record again I wanted to see what happens. F2. See duplicate value in unique index common column. So why? This is because we have declared employee ID as a unique and if you're trying to insert it again, it gives you an error like duplicate value in a unique index value. So that's the key which we have defined that is a primary key. That's how a, that's how its importance is. Okay, thank you so much for watching this video. I would like uh, we'll be coming with more videos. Stay tuned to YouTube channel. Have a great and pleasureful day.